Hello everyone, welcome to a new episode of uh, Malarachi 7, season 67, which is uh, the fifth season of uh, Audiology Tunes, which consists of season 63 to 70, and it's an October season, of course, and I am here, oh wait, I forgot the episode, the episode is 665, and I'm here with the one and only, what, what, can you, not bring in the British accent, alright? And by the way, my, my that's Jeff Wales. Yes, Jeff Wales, and I apologize for that. Okay, so today we are going to talk about um, uh, the changes uh, Jeff Wales has uh, been going through since uh, his first his first day in uh, Malonology, all the way to today. So, uh, any significance uh, whatsoever? Okay, so uh, the changes that I made, uh, what can I say, uh, that uh, the changes I made uh, since uh, the first day is that uh, I really look up to uh, the Molinology tunes like as they're my brothers. Because we've been, you know, a lot together and, uh, you know, with, like, you know, arguments all the way to surviving uh, many episodes, whether if it's like, oh, it's a first word problem versus a real life thing, you know, the part where, like, we almost literally die. Yeah. Happened in Fasoy, that happened in the Tell of My Life, I believe, Evil Tim, and, uh, I'm pretty sure they're, oh, yeah, no, wait. I think you're uh, thinking about, uh, MLY, right? Y Oh, I... Th oh! Oh, my God! Why can't I remember these things? Okay, so... Okay, you... Okay, to those people out there, uh... Who don't know what I'm talking about, uh, you know, what is MLY? Uh, Jeff Fels, please explain. Alright, uh, MLY stands for Mario, Luigi, and Yoshi, which was a former show in another channel called uh, Queen Bros uh, 1921 and it consisted of like 113 episodes uh, of uh, the content uh, featuring uh, the creator of Molinology and his young brother and uh, of course the creator played uh, uh, Mario and uh, his brother played uh, uh, Luigi and Yoshi you know, it was on PowerPoint form and uh, it ended with the movie the, the final movie and it was uh, more of a farewell to Emma White once and for all in other words, it was like uh, the creator of Molinology had to move on from here on out. There you have it, Fox, and Jeff Ells explained. And, uh, what do you think about uh, uh, the creator's brother in uh, Molinology? I, uh, he's quite a kook. That's all I can say. He's a kook. Whenever he plays gang guys, I thought like, oh my god, some of his characters uh, like are really terrible. Yeah, but th that's just my opinion, not the creators. Just so you know. Okay. Uh, anyway, uh, of course, uh, since you have nothing to do with uh, gang guys, uh, what do you think uh, about gang guys? Uh, I really think at first the gang guys uh, like was a bit more of a uh, great thing, but uh, at the it turns out that it got bland and shittier yeah, once uh, we get another Randy seasons, you know, from Revenge of Gang Guys or Gang Guys Strike Back or whatever. Yeah, those latest seasons got, like, crappier and I'm like, oh, please let it end. And it turned out, like, five years ago, I think, that was the last season of Gang Guys. And also because the creator of Molinology's brother, like, uh, the creator's brother, like, yeah, just, uh, like, didn't feel like, uh, like, guest starring it too often, you know. I mean, he, he could do it, you know. He said he could do it, you know, with more of the, uh, like, gang guys, uh, you know, characters he plays. But I really don't like the laughter, you know, from Cleveland. It sounds like a horse. Oh, really? Yeah. And, uh... If I were in it, I, I honestly get sick and tired of it already, you know. And uh, been mocked, uh, you know, like as they we're like stereotypical, uh, like people, you know, 
but even though we're from uh, like those countries and no we don't behave in a stereotypical way we just behave in our own ways trying to be as so okay 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 uh are you gonna uh ask me something else mike Okay, uh, let's see, let me think about it. Uh, what else, uh, like, uh, ha, ha, uh this, the changes uh, you've made? My god, I got nothing in my mind today, you know? I mean, I'm just, uh, feeling like I have a mind grind. My, what did I say about using my Australian accent? Sorry, oh my god, you know, I'm getting, I'm getting my my greens and uh, it takes okay to tell you the truth, uh, Jeff Ellis. You know, whenever I get a uh, my green, I tend to uh, uh, have uh, your, your accent, you know, which is obnoxious. Which I apologize uh, for that. Uh, no worries, my it's I mean, people are unique in many ways, yeah. So, uh, to answer your question, uh, what else uh, did I can do the changes? Okay, of course, uh, I really like, uh, you know, the gaming seasons, you know, I mean, it's not bad, you know, starting with the Super Mario Brothers, Super Mario 64, then uh, all the way to, uh, you know, other season, you know, other gaming seasons, and uh, especially live stream. I thought the live stream, like I said earlier, was uh, the best thing that's ever happened because I really wanted to do more of the live stuff. But too bad that time is really short and we could have used that time uh, for the live streams. But instead, we were a little too late, you know, for that. So, so yeah, we changed uh, over time, you know. Ba you know, we started from uh, the PowerPoint presentation in a crappy form to, of course, we st we're still in a cr um, a presentation form, but a little more improved because, uh, you know, the creator has experience with that and started to, uh, like, make it lo less crappy as possible every episode along the way, even though he tries to, but you know what I mean. Okay, yes, yes. Uh, if you all know, like, yeah, not all episodes are crappy, all ep most episodes are, but, uh, yeah. Okay, what else? Okay, uh, what else, uh, my... Okay, well, uh, you know, of course, so we got the PC. That's, uh, quite a boost, you know, halfway through. Oh, well, past halfway through. No, and ever since then, we didn't have much of technical problems. Unless uh, there's uh, anything along the way between now and all the way to the final deadline, which is June 11th, uh, 2020, at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Okay. So, uh, anything else you want to add? Um, like, anything else? Well, uh, let's see. Um, just, uh, well... Can I uh, just say, uh, in my opinion, uh, uh, regarding uh, uh, some uh, about molinologies to show you? You have thought about it? Well, okay. Here's my uh, critique of uh, molinology, you know, overall. Okay, we evolved along the way, you know. I mean, although we don't really get a lot of viewers, you know, which is kind of bland and quite quite shitty, but uh, Molinology isn't always about, uh, you know, with trends and all. The creator of Molinology had a thought that at first that it was all about uh, just uh, fame and money and all that, but it turned out you know, YouTube has changed a lot. Uh, everybody uh, uh, tend to feel that way, but, you know, at the end of the day, you know, the creator realized that it's not always about fame or fortune, it's always about, like, having fun making videos. Yeah, you know, I mean, even if uh, like you try to, uh, even if you do get like some fame out of it, you know, with thousands of views and stuff, but that's not really the point. The point is just to have fun. If you like to have, like to make videos, then that's uh, that's cool. And uh, then uh, over time, we realize that uh, you know we're a family. And I've said that in the previous episodes, but I wanted to make it clear. 
And then by the time uh, my knowledge comes to an end, we realize that uh, 10 years is worth changing our lives, despite uh, how crappy the content was. But at the end of the day, it was always about us. It was always about, like, creativity. It was always about trying to uh, last all the way through 10 years. It was always about, like, what has changed us, the, like, throughout that time. And what we've learned, and we've learned that, uh, we learned that, uh, like, being our true selves has always uh, made, made us better. But at the same time, being together, sharing each other's thoughts and stuff, meant a lot because we cared a lot about each other. And, uh, made us who we are today. And our bond is much stronger. And, uh, and we're going to miss the creator of knowledge after that. Even if uh, we end up uh, in another project after Molinology episode 1000, we'll see about that, mate. We'll see. Oh, for me, I think that's it, uh, Wilhelm. So, uh. So that's it. Yeah, mate. Any other questions? Uh, I think we covered uh, a lot, uh, if that's okay. Yeah, yeah, mate. Okay, so thank you for listening or watch, watching this podcast. And uh, don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, and share link this mini mini of our facts. And uh, Jeff is, give it a fay. Finish it off. Bye, my, my nets. See you next time. And love you all. Signing out.